everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Maria Sorreo, joined by Liz Brown Swanson. We are here at Trump National Golf Club. We are also joined by Lily Amini, and this, of course, is our holiday show. So we're here to talk about everything for the holidays, and we are joined by Chef Jean Pierre, who is over here making us a delicious appetizer, which we're all going to taste. Can't wait. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. But let's start with you, Lily, and tell us what's going on at Trump over the holidays. As you all know, Trump during the holidays is the best place to be. Uh, the lobby is decked out with Christmas decorations. A huge tree obviously is the focal point of the lobby. We get people from all over LA, obviously all our locals coming in to take pictures with it. It's amazing. We have tons of things going on as far as our food goes. Yes. Um, we have a Christmas brunch on the 21st, which we are very excited about, which Santa will be making an appearance. Oh, Santa. Yes, he will be. Um, on the 24th, Christmas Eve, we'll be having our prime rib dinner, which will be amazing as well. And Christmas Day, we are open with our entire menu um, open for everyone. Very good. Of course, we know it's always special to be here at Trump all year round, but especially over the holidays for you. We're sitting here by the fire and you say, you know, you always you come in here and it feels just warm and really it like does. you are at home. Definitely, definitely. I mean, it, and, and the lobby lends itself to feel like a very cozy, very homey type of place here. So we are looking forward to everyone coming down, smelling the sense yes. of the holidays as well <laughs> as we have here with, with Chef making his amazing dish that we're all oh going to taste. Gosh. And it's going to be a little bit of a, of, of a sample of what we have on our new holiday inspired menus as well we also have holiday inspired drinks coming up as well so we're mm, very very excited um, so yeah everyone you can definitely take a look at our website to see what events are coming up and if not you can definitely take a look at RPV TV to see what's coming up here yes sir absolutely and you know shopping of course during the holidays yep. is always important and people can shop right here at Trump gift cards definitely. tell us about that Definitely they can. Gift cards are always available online and at our pro shop. Gift cards are great for the golfer in your life as well as anyone who loves to dine here so that card can be used throughout the entire facility. So we're excited about that. And you, and you do have a fabulous gift shop just besides yes. the card to come in and spend it. Sure. I Definitely. know one of my favorite things you have here is all your glassware and your stemware. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Tons of glassware, tons of stemware. We have some new wine glasses that came in with the Trump logo as well. So people love that. And uh, hats. Hats are a very, Always very fun. popular thing. Always mm -hmm. fun. So visors and, and hats and, you know, the, the entire uh, pro shop is just decked out with anything you would want to give anyone in your life. So shirts, apparel, everything. Okay, I wish everybody could smell what we're smelling right <laughs> now, Chef. Now, tell us, tell us what you're making. I am making a uh, warm pumpkin spiced homemade gnocchi with uh, prosciutto di parma and a uh, little bit of fresh uh, cherry tomatoes. Very nice. Some uh, fresh sage and nice spiced toasted almonds. What is your favorite thing to make during the holidays? My favorite thing to make in the holidays is any dessert with uh, warm and uh, cold feel. Okay. So we're going to have a nice uh, white chocolate uh, peppermint bark ice cream okay. to go with some uh, flambéed uh, figs for Ooh. the holidays. And it looks like we're going to have to come back, Liz. <laughs> I know, I know. And, and Jean Pierre's talking about this delicious appetizer he has going on. I'm smelling pumpkin. But Amazing. you said there's also going to be some pumpkin happening yes, in the cocktails. There's going to be a pumpkin on the menu, and there's going to be lots of it everywhere. Mm. So this particular one is going to be with some nice uh, pecorino cheese Ooh. and a little bit of uh, sage garnish. Very nice. Oh my gosh, look at this. And of course, you can get this right here at Trump National over the holidays. And um, this is always the best place to come. Oh my gosh, look at how delicious that is. Beautiful. No calories <gasps> over the holidays. No, no calories. Right? No, calorie -free. Yeah. calorie free. Wow, that's fabulous. <laughs> yes. So we'll just like tip so it down so Mark can see. Oh yeah. Look at, Thank look, at, you. look at the beauty of this, please. It is a work of art. It is absolutely gorgeous. As all of Jean Pierre's work. Okay, so I think we're going to have to taste all right, this now, absolutely. of course. I have a fork for all three. Okay, okay. all right, right. there That's we go. Important. Thanks for sharing. Oh my gosh. Okay, right, no. we'll start with you, Lily. First yeah, spike Lily. goes to Lily. Yes. Uh -oh. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> oh. The look on her face Amazing. looks like I'm taking a bite now. <laughs> all right, mm. here we go. Oh my gosh. Our cameraman's saying, I'll, I'll get mine after. Mm hmm. Very good. Mm. That's fantastic. It is fabulous. Delicious. Anything with pumpkin in it. And I'm tasting mm, some like zest that's just beyond. It's yummy. Yeah, it's really, really good. And also, I would highly suggest a pumpkin pie martini. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. That would go great with this. All right, well, that was amazing. Liz and Lily are going to finish eating the gnocchi here. And then we're going to send Liz down to San Pedro to the Assistance League, where she's going to take us through a very special gift shop and post office. You're watching RPV TV. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock.
All right, as we continue our holiday special, I'm standing outside the only volunteer-run post office in the country. It is run by the Assistance League San Pedro South Bay. It's right here at Weymouth Corners in San Pedro on 8th Street. And along with going inside this post office, we're going to go next door to the gift shop run by the Assistance League, where all the proceeds help benefit the community. And you can be sure, right at the holiday times here, it is hopping. The gift shop is a little jewel here in San Pedro. Some people don't know about it. Once they come in here, they keep coming in. You know, there's really not any other places to shop for that perfect gift. Post office, of course, people just, you know, love coming to the post office. We're very proud of our little post office and we welcome you all to it. We became the first volunteer post office in the country back in 1964. In the beginning, we had a little counter in our gift shop, and we worked all the way up until we have our own freestanding structure. We can do all sorts of mail, except for delivery of mail. So other than that, you're a full-service post office? We are. We do not do money orders, but uh, aside from that, we can do anything else. We can serve all your needs. Oh, this is such a great place. The people are so friendly. The ladies are really nice. And it has a real hometown attitude, which I really like. And, uh, you know, the place next door has the cutest gifts. So I like to get some of the doilies they have or placemats. And they've got these adorable little Christmas ornaments. And just year-round, it's really nice. Plus, I like the fact that a lot of the proceeds are going for the charities. Sister Sleek has been in existence since 1936. And uh, one of our two biggest uh, uh, programs we have to fund is the... Um, a school bell, and uh, which clothes children in need, along with you know shoes and so forth, and our dental center. We take the needy children, families that cannot afford dental uh, care, and we also sponsor a orthodontic program. Uh, the post office gives us a stipend. And we can get up to about $6,000 a month from the post office to run this site. And that's put directly into our philanthropies and is directly used to support our charities. The gift shop is a year-round fundraiser here at the Assistance League and we donate 50% of our proceeds to the League to help pay for our dental center and our operation school bill. Half of our gift shop sales come from consignment items. We open up the back room which is our big auditorium, our meeting room, uh, and put merchandise in it for the holidays every year for six weeks. The gift shop is open Monday through Friday from 10 to 5 and on Saturdays from 11 to 3. During the holidays Days, we have like one uh, one of our auxiliaries, the Primeras. They adopt a family. They uh, feed, help feed the children at Toberman for their Christmas uh, dinners. We just had a very successful book drive in which we gave half of our books to the Boys and Girls Club of San Pedro. The other half went to Toberman. Our mission is to give to the community and also to um, adapt ourselves to what the community's needs are and doing this by all our volunteers working hard. We have a special thing in our hearts for the Assistance League. Last year they took care of clothing for 1,500 school children. So besides all of the frivolity that we see here, the Assistance League really does serious things. I shop here every Christmas, Liz, for Christmas and I have my eye on some great tea towels, basil tea towels and parsley. So that's where I'm going after I say goodbye to you. All right, so come on down to the Assistance League over the holiday season and, of course, all year round. I think I found my favorite holiday accessory. Definitely going to get me in the holiday spirit. Now let's join Maria Soreo in the studio. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. If you are looking for a unique holiday gift, well, look no further. You can do it right from your couch. We are now joined by Rena May. We met you at the Palos Verde Street Fair and Music Festival this year. Yes. Such unique jewelry items. We had to have you in for our holiday show because I've never seen anything like this. And Thank of course, you for having me. Yeah, our viewers are going to be excited to learn more about your jewelry, too. So, first of all, tell us about the necklaces because I think they're one of the most unique items I've ever seen for jewelry and you personalize every single one of them. Tell us about that. Yeah, so you know, I'm a woman and I have my ups and downs and I go through my mood swings and stuff and I really wanted to wear something that reminded me of like Rena, be patient, have balance in life, don't just focus on things. So I actually created something I call my super good luck charm bar. And what it is, it's a charm bar where you get to pick your 
own karma. And the way you pick your charms is, I tell people, what do you want to attract into your life or what do you want to be reminded of? So like, for example, family is the biggest thing in my life. Of and course. I have this amazing tree of life family charm that a lot of people like to put in the middle of their necklace. Um, so they are reminded of their family and their family's always with them wherever they are. Right. So people pick any five charms and it's great because you can mix gold with silver. Love that. Yeah, a lot of people are wearing gold and silver nowadays. And the best part is it's actually a long necklace. Mm -hmm. So, and then the greatest part about this is your birthstones. Yes, and tell us about the birthstones. Of course, I have my necklace on as well and I love it and my birthstone is on it, but it's just great because it has all the things that are important to me. So tell us about the birthstones. Yes. Yeah. So I created the birthstones because I think it's really nice and I think stones are really powerful in general mm -hmm. when you wear your birthstones right next to your heart. So mm -hmm. on Maria's, she has her birthstone, which is a sapphire. Right. And then on mine, I actually have my nieces and nephews' birthstones. <sighs> Great. So I feel like they're always with me no matter where I am and where I go. So I actually wanted to build a necklace. Okay. And yes, show you, let's show, let's show see you how, how you do it. it. Yes. I hand make all the jewelry so it comes from a really, really good place. These are the babies that make it. It so. does. <laughs> Your gifted hands. Thank you. <laughs> so these are five charms here, and they're a mixture of gold and silver, and I'm putting it on a silver chain. Okay. So the key symbolizes trust. The Nishu is the Japanese prosperity coin. The Tree of Life symbolizes family. Okay. The Celtic knot symbolizes good health, and the heart lock symbolizes love. Then I put it on the necklace like this, and then we have a November birthstone, which is topaz. Okay. We have an emerald birthstone, which is May, and we have an aquamarine birthstone, which is March. So I put all these on the necklace, and then what I do is I get it, and I will wire wrap it on, so it'll look like this. Wow. And they all stay together. They all stay together, so they're all together on the necklace. We'll wire wrap it on. You know what I love as well is with all of these birthstones, they all go together. People think, oh, green doesn't go with red or yellow or what have you. These all go together. So no matter what your birthstones that you want to put on, they're all special. Yes, I agree. And I think especially when they mean something to you. Of and course. It, and if it's your child or your husband right. or a family member, it's so awesome. So this is your baby. Look at that. And right you, here. you make them in different lengths as well. If somebody wants the necklace a little shorter, like mine's a little shorter, you do that as well. Yep. And the best thing is it comes on this card. So this is my super good luck necklace card. So you don't have to remember what all the charms mean. Great. So it comes packaged. So if you order it online, it comes packaged like this, and they make the best gifts. The, the best gifts. In fact, I ordered one for a friend of mine for her birthday, and I have to tell you the way that it came in the mail was so special. In a beautiful little box with a card that I actually kept with affirmation on it that I put on my mirror and I read every morning. So I thought that was so unique and special. No one's ever done that before. Aww. Now show us a few other things before we wrap up, um, and then you're going to actually put a bracelet on me. I'm I so am. excited. So tell us about the good luck bracelets and some of the other things that you have. Great. So some of my most popular bracelets right now is my, my Priceless collection. This is a bracelet called I Am Priceless, and the affirmation on it is I Am Enough. This is a great gift for a daughter or for someone going into transition that kind of questions themselves. I've been wearing mine for two years now, and I've never taken it off. This is a bracelet. It says the bracelet you never take off. Swim, shower, it all works. And you can do that pretty much with all the bracelets. You can just leave them on. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. And then it's my friendship bracelet. If you want to give it to a friend, it says you get me, I get you. One of the other greatest presents that I think is awesome is I have a necklace called You're Perfectly Unperfect. Oh, great. And what it says is the last line, and it says, let this piece remind you of your awesomeness because you are an original and you are one of a kind. So this is a 14 karat gold filled necklace. So this too, you can shower, you can swim with it. It's made of amazing quality also. Great. Well, you've got so many great things now. You're going to put a bracelet on me before we wrap up. Remember, it's maymaydejewelry.com. We're going to put that up for you so you can remember to order. And please order by December 15th because this month goes by so incredibly fast and we want to make sure you get your May, May jewelry because it's so amazing. So tell us about the two bracelets that you have on. Yeah, so this is my change bracelet. And I think that 
a lot of times we go through change and it feels uncomfortable. So this says, may this bracelet be a symbol of faith, trust, and acceptance. Change is inevitable in life. Embrace it, go through it with grace, and watch life unfold exactly the way it was meant to be. And I know, Maria, you are going through a little bit of change. I am. And you want to be reminded to embrace it. I know. So what it is, it's a Swarovski crystal in the middle. And it's made, the Oops. silver is made of sterling silver and the gold is a 14 karat gold filled material. So you can wear it always and never take and it I off. never have to take it off. I love that. All right. Remember again, it's MayMayJewelry.com. Thank you so much for being with Thank us you. today, Arena. And when we come back, Liz is going to take you to some very cool ornaments on the hill. You're watching RPV TV. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Hi Maria, I'm definitely at one of my favorite places to do holiday shopping, but really shopping all year long. I'm at the Point Vicente Interpretive Center gift shop. I'm with Emily, who is a recreation specialist here at PVIC. Thanks for joining us once again. We have fun together shopping. It's always a blast. And of course, one of the nicest things you can get here, I think at the holiday time, are ornaments. You have the most beautiful ornament selection that you, you put together on this lovely tree. So let's kind of show our, um, our audience what we have this year. Yeah, the great thing about our gifts here is that they're all geared towards what we do, and it's about the marine life, the Palos Verdes Peninsula, so it's a lot of unique things that you can come in and get. It's not what you're going to find in your general gift shop, so you should come on down. All right, we've got lots of sparkly ornaments in the basket. Some of our, our favorites we kind of went through. It's one of the fun ones here. we got a Sea Star Santa, so at the museum here we have some tide poles, so it's kind of a replica of that, you know, and tie in the holiday spirit. And we also got this beautiful, we have an assortment, but it's a capiche shell. It's really beautiful. It's a, a seahorse. One of the favorites, very simple but elegant. It's a peacock ball. I was going to say, you'll find a lot of peacocks on this tree. I bought this one last year. This is really fun because you can just kind of clip it on. Yeah, exactly. So we've got different varieties. We've got tree clips and hanging ornaments. Fun one for kids. It's kind of whimsical, but it's a little glass whale. And we also have a little glass sea turtle. So that's good for the children. You really have an incredible variety. I mean, you have all, you have lots of glittery ones and, and of course, these beautiful wooden ones. I, I bought these anchors last year. Like, theirs are fun because you can actually put them, with, like when you're wrapping a present, you can just put that on the outside exactly. of the gift, exactly. obviously hang it on the tree. But these definitely um, reflect the local marine life here. And um, this is really fun. Yeah, if you have a little comedian <laughs> at home, this is a perfect one. It's a Santa in a shell uh, riding a dolphin. So it's kind of like a dolphin sleigh. So this is a good one to bring home. Now, I, when I come here, Emily, I'm always thinking, what's new on the tree at PVIC at the holiday time? And you have some really cool new metal ornaments. So let's showcase those. I'll help you because there's so many oh, different yeah ones that we can show. These are great. Yeah, so these are just made out of assorted metals. There's no lead in it, so it's perfectly safe, and it actually has a good cause behind it. And if you come in, we'll tell you a little bit more about them. But as you see, we have the pelican here, a beautiful mermaid with her shell. I'm holding the octopus, and of course, the lighthouse. We always think of the lighthouse here um, at Point Vicente, and of whales, all about the yeah. whales. And there's you another That's whale one, one of the too. cute whales. Yeah, we have a different assortment of whales, but this one's yeah. adorable. And our cameraman, Mark Dotty, thought, you know what, they even would look good as jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> but these are really, really fun. And you know what's great about all the ornaments here? It's just they're really reasonably priced, so you can yeah. just get some really cool gifts. Speaking of moving on to some other fun gifts that are new this year, it's all about relaxing at the holidays. I'm, I'm good with this one, bath salts. Yeah, this bath salt is actually, if you open it up, we have samples here and you can smell it, but it's such a great smell. Let me, peppermint, let me, just pepper, opens peppermint you right up. Peppermint for the holidays, yeah, so. beautiful. We also have some pomegranate scents, and these are actually local on the peninsula. The uh, little gal grows them in her garden, the flowers and the scents and then mixes them into her batches for her bath salts and um, sugar scrubs. I think it's so nice, like you said, you try to keep things in the gift shop here that really yes. reflect the community spirit, what the peninsula is about with the marine life. And of course, inside the gift shop, you've just got something for everybody. You know, there's lots of toys for kids, stocking stuffers. Yeah. You really, really have quite a selection. Yeah. Um, and we'll have to just get everyone to come in and shop here. But what I really love is just the specialty items you have, like you have beautiful stemware, dishes, and uh, we all need to toast at the holidays. What do yeah. you think? Should we do a? Yeah. Cheers, Cheers to the holidays and shopping right here at PVIC. Um, anything you want to add? We want to tell everyone to come down for the hours here if they yeah. want to pick out some of these great things. And so our hours are pretty much every day, uh, 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. So that's Monday through the weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Now, the only days we're closed is Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, New Year's Day, and of course Thanksgiving Day. All right. Well, here one more cheers yeah. to shopping at PVIC at the holidays. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. 
from PVIC. I just traveled down the coast to our favorite resort, Terranea. I am here now with Maria and the president of Terranea, Terry Hack. Always great to be here for the holiday time. How is it all coming together? I know you're extremely busy. It's very exciting. It's such a festive time of the year. Hard to believe this is our sixth holiday season. So we're very, very excited and there's a lot going on. Lots of elves running around. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of elves. And I know you have so much going on. Tell, tell us about some of it. Yes, um, the first weekend after Thanksgiving is our traditional tree lighting, and that is um, open to all of our neighbors and friends in a very fun family evening. You know, it really kind of sets off, I think, the whole holiday season because everyone comes out. It's usually chilly outside, and it's nice to kind of just bond together and, and meet everyone in the community out there. It's really such a wonderful night. We have um, Breakfast with Santa. That's coming up on the Saturday, the 20th of December. Last year, we sold out, so we had some of our residents kind of disappointed that they couldn't do that. So um, please make your reservations early if they'd like to do that. And of course, the best way to do that is to go onto the website. Can you yes. do that through that, which is terranea.com? That is. Because like you have something that like you say going on here weekly. Mm -hmm. we what do. are some of your favorite things to do here over the holiday season at the resort? I love just walking around and seeing the lights, seeing our tree. Breakfast with Santa is such a wonderful day when you see all the children all dressed up and very, very excited. We celebrate Hanukkah throughout the Hanukkah season that's here great. by lighting the menorah every evening. So that's very exciting. That's very cool. We have um, New Year's Eve. So yes. I can't forget that. And um, a lot of different parties for New Year's Eve, depending on whether you want a family evening or um, our dance party. And when you say family, I think this really has become a place of tradition since you've been open for sure. five full years, your sixth holiday season. People want to come here with their families and celebrate. And there's so many different things. There's buffets. You have just lots happening. We do. And I think there's a little bit of something for everyone. Um, Maria, our shop, has some wonderful gifts. And if you can't really decide what you want, there's so many gift cards. Yes. So please feel free gift cards to the spa and to golf. It's really a fun time. Well, and that's always such a great choice too because you don't know what to get somebody everybody loves to come here so that's fun yes it really is and they can kind of make up their own Christmas or their own Hanukkah depending on what they want to do so we have a generic um, gift card and so we can just say to Terranea and they can use it at the spa or Nelson's or Maria very nice. Now, Terry, we all like to eat, of course, and I know that your pastries here are, are five star for sure. Yes, we're, <laughs> that's why I look like this. <laughs> I eat all the pastries. Um, I thought there were no calories at the holiday no time. no calories. I forgot, I forgot. Yeah. Yes, our, our pastry chef, Chef Perry, is just a delight. He's been with us since pre-opening, wow. um, actually with, with our company for 19 years. He's very, very accomplished. And what's your favorite? Oh my gosh, I couldn't tell because then he wouldn't let me, um, if he would own, yeah, Does it have I keep to have sampling everything. <laughs> yes, chocolate's good, but there's berries, there's just an array of just wonderful, wonderful delights. And our guests and residents can purchase them and take them home, Amazing. put them in their own pans and kind of look like they made them. I know, I was going to say that. You can, you know, take out here at Terrane if you don't, if you aren't going to come and stay, right. whether it's sweets and treats or meals. I know you actually do like turkey dinners, all that, but they need to order. Right. We do order in advance, but we do um, take out dinners for Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, New Year's, um, and really all throughout the season. So it's really, it's so wonderful when you're so busy and you can just order your dinner yes. here, take it home and have this wonderful dinner. Well, I think we're going to send Liz actually over to the pastry chef. Oh, and no. she, Yes, I got I know. the without sweet me. job. I know, without me, she's going to go the there by herself. Job. Yes, yes, yes. But it's so fun that you took some time yes. out to share and um, just wish you and your family the best holiday season ever. Right. And also right here at the resort. We'll yep. be here. Well, thank you so much. And we wish all of our neighbors and friends just a truly wonderful holiday season. So now I'm here with the sweet story at Terranea. And to tell the tale, I have the executive pastry chef joining me chef perry it is wonderful to be here with you once again at dessert time look at these marvelous treats talk about Thank what you, you so have much. here with your beautiful desserts well welcome this is a perfect time of the year you know to enjoy some flavors we try to cultivate some of the genuine flavors locally here from california of course and bring in the spices and the flavors of the season and starting of course with your traditional pumpkin pie Right here, beautifully decorated with a dab of whipped cream over the top. It's got a nice organic cinnamon to it with a nice uh, flaky pie crust 
is delicious. I never of seen course, like the holidays though without pumpkin pie. That's a pie. traditional thing, you know. Then you got your apple pie. You got to have that, but you can't stop just there. You got to have something more exciting. I think you're getting enticed to your your customer with something different. What about a Nutella cupcake? Very festive, very chocolate fun. infused with the Nutella, chocolate buttercream, and. Uh, his and that chocolate on the outside, which a nice little dab of color of uh, crispy chocolate over the top. This burst of the holiday yep. feel with that nice red on the top and, and no calories in this one. Just a little bit of color. <laughs> and all these things, of course, they're available grab and go in sea beans, and you can adorn your table during the holiday or any time of the year, pretty much. We ch try to change throughout season all the way through, so we try to bring in the freshest flavor, whatever it's in season right now, like this sweet potato cheesecake, ganache, candied oranges over the top, brittles, cookies, fudge, double chocolate fudge cookie, shortbread cookie with raspberry jam. It's a nice decadent and red light, and this, it's a gluten-free cookie. It's called Richard Ellis, original from Siena, Italy. It's celebrated during the holiday a lot, and it's gluten-free. This you have to try. I'm gonna try this new. I don't think I've actually yet sampled anything gluten-free. I'd probably benefit from from probably focusing on a little gluten-free items, but uh, this looks lovely. This you will enjoy. It's definitely delightful. And of course, this is amazing. I wish I had a cup of coffee. I know we can probably arrange for that at Sea Beans when I finish this. No. I understand that there's some real excitement happening here as we speak with some gingerbread building. What is happening? Well, I have to take you back there. Then you can see that. Really <laughs> it's a sneak preview of what's to come. Preview of what's to come. But you are building a spectacular gingerbread yes, house right now. Yes, we're building two gingerbread houses. One on display here in the lobby, and the next one is going to be in a signature coffee shop, Sea Beans. And I'm sure in Sea Beans, all through the season, you can get your gingerbread people. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we got to be politically correct. What do you enjoy most about the holidays right here at Terranea? This you've been here since the resort opened. Yes, it's been fun. I mean, uh, the holidays bring us a lot of people together. I think a lot more people come around to see what flavors are there. And it's nice to have some place like Sea Beans to showcase all these items and bring all those flavors together. And that's the fun thing about watching the people and enjoying it your creations. Well, thank you day. for sharing all these beautiful creations. And again, we want everyone to know to come on by Sea Beans, come to the resort, and order up your desserts for the holidays. Yes. This is delicious. Bon appetit. Well, I think one of the best things about the holidays is all the treats that we get to have. And that was quite amazing, that gingerbread house that they're making, Liz. It was fabulous. And all those sweets and treats. And I didn't forget you. She did it. She, she brought was, some pumpkin pie. I brought you pumpkin pie. You know, we started off the beginning of our holiday we show did. with Trump eating pumpkin, pumpkin. yogi, which were delicious fabulous yes of course. and i think now it's time to try the pumpkin pie which is so traditional right to have Very this much. all right here we go yes Let's and see. thank you so much for joining us and enjoy your holiday season and we'll see you in 2015 happy, happy holidays pie. everyone